Hi guys! So today I am back with another makeup tutorial. This is a holiday inspired makeup tutorial. I'm so excited. I like freak when it's the holidays, you know, Thanksgiving, Christmas time, even Halloween, but especially Christmas time. I just get so excited. I just love like Christmas spirit. I know that can be annoying to some people. I annoy myself sometimes with it, but I don't know, I just love it so much. So of course one of my favorite parts about the holidays is dressing up, getting dolled up, and of course for me that has a lot to do with what my makeup looks like. So I wanted to do the Christmas and New Year's Eve tutorial combined in one. I literally took my Christmas makeup and just transformed it into New Year's Eve makeup. Um, my favorite part though is of course the New Year's glitter, gold glitter, and the red matte lip because I'm, you know, it's a red matte lip. Like what gets better than that? Like there's nothing better than that. It's just super festive. Who doesn't love glitter? Like I love glitter. Like I just want to throw glitter in the air like Kesha. You know what I mean? I just love glitter. Um, so festive, it's just so fun, you know? Glitter just makes me happy. I'm gonna stop rambling now. So anyways, I really hope that you guys enjoy this tutorial and are excited as I am for the holidays. Love you guys so, so much. I hope that you guys enjoy and I will talk to you guys later. Mwah. Bye. So I'm starting off with my eyelids already primed. I'm taking Fawn and I'm going to start running this into my crease just to create some depth and this is going to also be a transition color. I'm going to take Half Baked from the original Naked palette and I sprayed my brush with some Evian facial spray so I could foil the eyeshadow, make it look more pigmented, and I'm just applying this all over the lid. I forgot to show a clip of it, but I'm taking nylon eyeshadow and just applying that under my brow bone and inside my tear duct as my highlight. I'm taking dark horse eyeshadow. It's like a cool um, dark gray color and I'm just applying this to the outer crease of my eye. taking some more of that fawn and blending it right above that dark horse to make sure there isn't any harsh lines. So just for the sake of time I applied my winged liner off camera, used the Maybelline gel eyeliner and an angled eyeliner brush from Sephora. Now I'm applying mascara, voluminous carbon black like always. Then I'm going to take my eyeliner, this is just a regular black pencil, I think it's by Rimmel, and I'm going to tight line my eyes with this, and then I'm also going to apply this to my waterline and to my lower lash line, and then I'm going to blend it out with some of that dark horse. I'm going to take some of that half-baked eyeshadow and apply it on the lower inner corner of my lashes um, just to kind of open up my eyes and bring some of that gold and warmth down there. Then don't forget to apply mascara to your bottom lashes. Then I am applying my uh, lashes. These are number 605 Spike Creme. Now it is time for the lips. My favorite part, I'm taking this red lip liner by Jordana. I will put the name down below. Lining my lips with this, I'm going to fill them in partially leaving um, the middle bare. For my lipstick, I am taking Russian Red. 
um, by MAC. It's just a beautiful fire engine red and it is matte. So I'm obsessed, obsessed. This is seriously like my favorite red lipstick in the whole world. No matter how many I buy, I always go back to this one. So taking Warm Soul Blush, um, I just wanted a neutral, mauve um, glowy type blush. So I didn't, you know, overpower my face since we have the red lips. Then highlighting um, with Josie Moran Argan Oil. This is like their illuminating highlighter. Um, very soft. It's, it gives more of just like a sheen of glow than anything. So that's why I took this one because again, I don't want to overpower um, the rest of my face. So applying that to where the light would naturally hit my face. And we are done with the Christmas look. This is it. Super glam, very classic. Love it. Now we're going to go a little crazy and start with the New Year's look. So taking carbon eyeshadow, just a matte black, and I'm going to start um, applying this to the outer V of my eyelid. I'm taking my gel eyeliner again and I'm just dragging it a little bit into my inner corner just to kind of make it a little bit more um, sexy, a little bit more um, smoky, a little bit more cat eye. <laughs> um, yeah, if you can see the difference. It just really drags in and um, emphasizes the shape of your eyes. So I'm applying my glitter glue. This one is by e.l.f. It's pretty good. It's not the best, um, but it was a dollar. so. Um, it's easy to work with, and then I'm taking Sally's um, Gold Glitter and applying that to my eyelids. And we are just going to repeat the same thing for the other eye. And this is pretty much the finished look. I love you guys so much, and I will talk to you guys later. Mwah. Bye. <laughs> what do we do while we wait for our lashes to dry, ladies? Listen to Romeo Santos. That's what we do. If you don't know who Romeo Santos is, girl, look him up. Listen to his music. Even if you don't understand Spanish, translate that because it's like... Every guy needs to want to treat his girlfriend like Romeo Santos, you know, does. I'm just talking crap. But seriously though, like, we're meant to be.